Order in the court. I'm doing another verdict watch for Keaton Boggs, five years old out of Lost Creek, Virginia. His, his paternal grandmother, Michelle Boggs, 48, had custody of him at this time. Unfortunately, Keaton's mother was going through a drug dependency, so she would end up losing custody on her son. And Keaton's father had died prior to Michelle Boggs getting custody of her grandson. So Michelle Boggs, 48, and her daughter, Chastity, 29, and her son-in-law, Peter Wazinski, 32. All three of them are charged with murder. Keaton died on March 20th, 2020. He sustained bleeding on his brain, in his eyes, bruising all over his body, ear trauma. He had half inch laceration to his penile shaft. His grandmother had threatened to cut his penis off. He also had injuries to his testicles and inner thighs. Michelle Boggs also did not let her uh, grandson's mother even visit him. I guess because she would probably found out what was going on with him. Uh, Chastity, the aunt, would cover up Keaton's bruises with makeup. So this went undetected for a little while. Uh, Michelle has peripheral artery disease and a heart attack. So she was, she well, she had a heart attack. So she was um, trying to get out of um, jail. Um, her lawyer was saying COVID-19 made her vulnerable and she can get it if she stayed in jail. No deals. The judge made her ass stay in there where she's still in there and that's good. So this is terrible. Even in the pictures, you can see Keaton's forehead had swollen twice its size and he probably was in pain, still trying to smile through it and open up his gifts. I mean, terrible. This is what you do to your grandson. Absolutely terrible. Keaton Boggs, five years old.